Wow, <laughs> it's official, ZXXR, G1, 1998, can pull away in fourth. It doesn't like it, but it can pull away in fourth. Who'd have fucking thought? <laughs> no, no telling the damage I've just done to my gearbox and engine doing that. Where I can't see any liquids trailing. I'm gonna go ahead and assume all as well. Are you shitting me right now? Fuck's sake. Son of a bitch. Okay, that thing I wanted to talk about, it is actually starting to rain, but I'm going to do it anyway. Um, I only get like an hour and a half to two hours sleep before, before my day shifts. This was one of them. And I had a very peculiar dream. <laughs> very peculiar indeed. I had a dream that I was... For lack of a better word, piss-assing about with Mord F13. Now, besides YouTube comments, I've never spoken to Mod F13, other than the comments. I think I've, I think I've had like two or three comments with him. But I had a dream about the fucker. Oh, piss. I can make it. So yeah, I have this really fucked up dream. Like, it's an hour and a half asleep and I had this dream. Where me and the uh, almighty lord Mord F13 were just piss assing about playing silly games on like a football table and shit. And yeah, thanks for pushing through, you cunt. Jesus Christ. At least you've got a bit of fucking sense. And uh, we are just piss assing about really. Going out on little push bike rides, a little motorbike ride here. And it was weird. You know, you have one of them dreams, and it genuinely weirds you out a bit. You're like, what the fuck? And before anyone says it, no, there was nothing sexual about the dream. Although, if there was going to be, he is a fantastic bastard. But, no, there was nothing sexual about I mean, if there had been, it might have made a bit more sense, you know. At least something sexual you could get away with. But, no, nothing. Not even the remotest, littlest bit of sexualness in this dream. It was just literally me and Mordeth 13 hanging out as if we were mates. I don't know if that's my brain trying to tell me I'm longing for companionship. Me. But it was weird. Uh, I bet if he knew about this dream, he'd be weirded the fuck out. <laughs> you get an email from him saying, Stop dreaming about me, you crazy fuck. Oh, you crazy English bastard. Now, I wish I could explain it. I mean, the only thing I can tie to it is the day before I watched his scooter crash from a few years before. And then him riding a push bike with his mate. But in, in the past, I've watched 
episode after episode, you know, I've done from his first video up until his latest, and I've kept up. Which, may I remind you, is like 1,300 something videos. That takes a fucking long time to get through. But I did, when I was uh, learning to ride, I used to watch all his videos. Because not only does he give, give sound advice, but he's actually quite entertaining. I'm not plugging his channel, though. <laughs> Subscribe to me, you fuckers, not him. And, uh, basically... Uh, yeah. I don't know. It's not like I've watched a hundred of his videos recently. I used to. I used to go for about five or... No, that's a bit under what I used to do. Basically, I used to work in a factory, where I still work, but my job was shit, and I hated it. So to cheer myself up, I used to just sit in the evenings before bed for two, three hours just watching more Death 13 videos. And I started at one, and I made my way all the way up to his latest. Like a sad fuck. Don't ask me to quote anything, because my brain's so full of shit at the moment, I couldn't quote a thing. But yeah, so yeah, there you go. Weird dreams about a motor vlogger, not even one I've met. Weird shit. No doubt someone will analyse that dream and tell me I'm actually gay and I really want to suck his dick. But I don't. But someone will try and tell me that. Ah, twat. Again with the engine. I think it's the carbs, to be honest, because they're acting weird again. Like the other day, I couldn't get any throttle response, and today it's lurching almost as if they're opening too much all of a sudden. Like you throttle on, and then they suddenly just get that second wind. Now I'm used to that. Trust me, as I've been riding this bike for a few years now, and I know how the bike acts. But it's completely out of character. It's getting its second wind before it's at its first. You wind it on, and it goes blah, 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 like that, and you're like, but why? I didn't do anything to warrant that response. So I think the throttle just needs um, throttle cable and and the actual oh, thinking. The carbs. Fucking idiot. God damn it. Oh, now you fucking stay on when I'm about to turn you off, you prick. God fucking damn it. You know what the weird thing is, is I hang out with, well I used to a lot, Lewis. I've hung out with other moto vloggers. I don't even dream about them fuckers and I do hang out with them. You know, they're the people you'd expect to fucking dream about. You know, people you know, people you've hung out with, you have dreams about what you've done. I'm just being a weird fucking dreaming about anything. It might actually be time to get me feckin' head checked. Roll on payday and get this bike sorted out. Back out in a minute to clean that because it's fucking disgusting. Fucking birds. <laughs>